today's a really special day because as you can see right now we're at headquarters but we're gonna head down to Valdosta Georgia Jake reached out to make a wish and really wanted an ATV and we're super stoked to be able to make that happen so we've loaded up a 2024 Can-Am Outlander XT 1000 R and we're gonna bring it down to Jake in Valdosta and surprise him Pile on. I, I might be able. To, I might be able to you get a couple, might, two minutes worth of look on. at it. Yeah, <laughs> you might, he might let you look at it, but that's yeah. about it. Yeah, I, I want to cry, but I, I, at the same time, I'm kind of shocked. Uh, We first heard about Jake and um, were reached out about him for a possible wish. It was in 2020 mm -hmm. um, and he wanted a four-wheeler more than anything but at the time he was too young. A lot of years have rocked by and it's been a long time coming for this wish. You needed your favorite thing. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> so if you don't have any food to eat for the next Oh my god. Sure. Yeah, the shirt for each of y'all. We live in the deep south. We live in the country. We're surrounded by farmland. Everyone around here as a young child grew up with a four-wheeler. That's just accepted that by the time you got to be a certain age, you were on a four-wheeler. And he never had that opportunity. And he's always wanted one, and we got fortunate. This is what he wanted. This is 100% his, 100% him. This is a Can-Am. <laughs> 2024 Can-Am Outlander XT 1000R, so 1000cc engine. It can do a lot. Yeah, you got the heavy-duty front and back bumpers. So, mom was tearing up earlier. You know, watching him get on and and ride the four-wheeler, and he's so excited. Like he didn't sleep last night. <laughs> he's just been so excited about this, and y'all have really made his day, really his his whole life. <laughs> That's so much power. <laughs> oh my god. I went like a little bit farther than like not even halfway there. And it, it just kept it. It's just like the jump from like 15 to 22 is crazy. I've wanted one for so long. When I got on it, and then I felt like how it rides, I couldn't ask for anything better. It, it was literally the colors exactly how I wanted it. The the ride is amazing. The helmet's comfortable. Everything everything about it is just like amazing. When I was driving it, I don't know if it was the adrenaline or, or whatever, but I felt I felt happy and. Um, Probably more happy than I've felt in a while. That feels so bad. Oh my god. Oh my god. Well, our journey started in 2011, and um, Melissa, my wife, called me and said, You need to come on, and uh, went to the hospital. He was in serious cardiac distress. Uh, we immediately went to Macon, spent the overnight in Macon, and the doctor in Macon sent us to Eggleston Children's Hospital in Atlanta, and we stayed there through Christmas. I'm just going to be real here. It's depressing in the hospital. I knew, because I've been there my first few times, I just see how fortunate I am to be here. How fortunate I am to be able to be here in this yard and ride this, then be in the hospital again with a pick line in, wires all over my body. Seeing him smile just warms my heart. Um, to know that he has not only been 
a wonderful child to raise. He is turning into a wonderful adult. What I've learned is not just in the hospital, but if you treat people with respect, you'll get respect back. Just be kind, because you never know what could happen tomorrow. You can never know what could happen five minutes from now. Yeah, I like it. Yeah, I like it. <laughs> I've seen a lot of cool make wishes. I have friends that have had make wishes. I think mine's the coolest, though. As you can see, I like speed, but I also like going through the mud. This is like the perfect combination of both. It goes faster than I thought it would, <laughs> a lot faster than I thought it would. And as you can tell, I can put it through, I put it through everything I wanted to put it through. Everything that I eyeballed, I went through and it went perfectly fine. Besides that one time I got stuck, but when I was stuck, it took 15 seconds for that amazing winch to get out. And um, 
I can feel the wind on my face and it's just like it's very calming but also the adrenaline is like battling that <laughs> so it's just like all the good emotions all in one mixed into a cup and you uh, shook it up that's what I felt <laughs> I still feel the adrenaline I've been feeling adre adrenaline since you guys came I mean it, it was fantastic I had I had the most fun I've ever had